Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Mega G Wolf, and welcome back to Bevel's Painting. So, during editing, I did think of something else, and I feel like this game is actually trying to encourage you to play it knowing things you shouldn't know. So, like, foreshadowing, I guess, or like metagaming? I don't know, but we're going to play it again from the beginning, because now that we know certain things, we don't have to use certain items, which might mean it opens up new ways of doing things. So, I'm really looking forward to seeing if this changes a whole lot, because uh, there are quite a lot of endings to get. So, I don't know if it's talking to this person, or if I have to go in here, that triggers the painting to work, but I'm going to do both, just because, I don't know. Also, I, I kind of don't know why I didn't figure this out. Uh, the writing by the girl's name is Bevel. So we are actually playing as Bevel, which uh, makes sense. When you think about what the name of the game is, I mean, you know, I'm just saying. Uh, okay, let's go in here. So we're going to be kind of doing the... We're going to be treading over the same ground, but taking a different approach in certain things, just because uh, I believe that's what the game intends us to do. Because there are lots of things that we could and couldn't do that had no purpose, right? And the painting, for example, or like that drawing of the door with the candle, gave me a clue. It was like, there is another way to make a door black, rather than have that girl give you the paint. So I'm like, okay... Well, the only other instance I can think of that I could know information outside of doing the puzzle would be the button with the mirror. So, I am curious how this is going to play out, because I want to see if it really affects things. Because having certain items at certain other points might actually be really, really useful. And away we go! I don't know how much it will add or if it will do anything different. So I'm curious about that. This might only be like a one episode thing, for all I know. Okay. Hey there, bunny. Okay, so. This is nice and the same. I guess I can overwrite stuff, because I don't need my old saves. Eat it up, meat. I'll eat it all. Om nom 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 nom. Was certainly tasty. And I have to get my paintbrush back. You boo do do do. I always like this beginning. It's uh, very. Oh, what am I doing? <laughs> silly me, silly bevel. Look what silliness you you've started right now. Can't believe you'd be so silly. Uh, I could do this up here though. Ah, yeah, putting that circular one in there is a lot better to begin with, it seems, because I just get more room to maneuver. So one other thing I wanted to try is I want to try and force Beverly's to actually be in the correct language, which I should have tried at the beginning, actually, but it doesn't matter. I don't know if it works for everything, because it worked for that draft, right? Or whatever it was. So I'm wondering if it's going to work for other things. I'm curious. So this area doesn't seem like anything could be different. As far as I'm aware. So we will use the blue paint. Yes! Yay! The door is now blue. Let's go! See, this takes like way less time when I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Where is back here? Can I actually go back here? No, I can't. Alright, sweet. Didn't know that. Still don't know what that is. Or why it's there. Can I go back to that? I can. What is the point in that, though? Don't know. Interesting that I can go back here, but I can't go back to the other one. But whatever. Whatever floats your boat. I ain't picky. Yay! Okay, we're here now. So this is where things start to change, right? So... Where do I want to actually start doing this? I guess it would be... That I probably don't... It probably doesn't matter that I don't have the... Mirror shard right now? Because I know what the gimmick is. Oh no, but I need the scissors. Uh, I also cleaned my brush. 
Yeah, I need the scissors, right. Where were they? Were they just in the room with the piano guy, right? I think so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Hi, buddy. We're gonna kill you in a more traditional way. I say traditional. Nothing like the old scissors in the top of the head, but... We're gonna be trying something a little bit different with that guy this time around. Alright, so... Whoop. So we get the scissors, cut that. Yeah, hidden passage. Slightly bent. That's why I, it was interesting that they were slightly bent. Yes. Press the switch, didn't even fix the mirror. That's how pro we are. Green paint. Now, I don't believe there's anything in here of interest, so we'll go out. So now, we've kind of skipped a section. And we have an extra item available to us. Well, when we go there, anyway. Now, I don't remember if I have to activate... Lady trying to get into the painting before I can get the mirror to break. There she goes. Let me in! <laughs> I'm still surprised that worked, by the way. Hi! Boom. Okay. Go to the red world. Thank you. It's a nice mirror shot. I like it. Now, I don't think there's anything else to get around here, so... We paint this, yes. Tree! Yay! The door was unlocked. Clean the dirty brush. Okay, so... With this now, what we can do... Is, instead of the scissors, put the mirror shard in. Yeah! Yeah, heard a stabbing sound. All right, now things are going to be different. Things are going to start to be a little bit interesting because now we have a different method of being able to think about things. So I'm curious what kind of outcome we're going to have now. The skulls. They're alive. I've never seen one kill me. Okay, they just stabbed me. Great. <laughs> Amazing. I thought they were going to do something cool, but no, apparently they just stabbed me. That's nice. Okay. So, I also wonder if not cleaning the brush in that room, like the red room, is a big deal or not? I want to experiment with that room a bit more before we actually do anything like that. Hmm. I don't know, because then, then it comes to a point where I'm just not sure what can and can't be done. I like how it's red paint and not just blood. <laughs> the door is now red. The brush is now dirty. Okay. I've also, I've heard this sound before. I've heard this particular sound used in uh, when I've seen people uh, play Owl Oni. So I'm like, oh god, that song. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. I'm going to make a lot of saves in a lot of different places for this because I don't know if I'm meant to do things differently or not now. I think going down a certain path means that what does this say anyway? Can I force this? No. Is it only the giraffe thing I can force to make it easier? Because I guess that it would, like, not being able to think about checking behind a pillar would be a little annoying. So I guess that would make sense that that kind of gives you a bit of a push in the right direction. Alright, so... I think we go straight down, right? Oh god, I only played this a little while ago and I'm already forgetting everything. So that's, that's going to be the usual, I think. Yeah, because the desk key's in this room. Bum. Okay, something in the skull. There's something in the skull! There's also a skull in there. I don't know if there's a way for me to get in there or not. But it doesn't seem like there is. I don't think... I don't know what this says. And it doesn't say... There. This book says something. Uh, it's like three words. Uh, maybe... 
I, I don't know. <laughs> a blank canvas. I don't know. It's weird that those are down there, because I really don't need them. So I'm curious what that is, and that's why I want to make a save here, just in case there's something else I can do at that point. And I'm going to want to make a save for it just in case. Maybe I paint the book blue and I can bring the book? No, the, the book red, sorry, with the lipstick I get later? I don't know. It's interesting. One dead kid. No, she was so young. Her name was Mary. But she died. Okay. Save there. So we got the desk key. So we can open this. Oh. Ah. Desk key. Red key. Go back and forth. Back and forth. <laughs> it's like a lot more back and forth when you realize what you actually have to do. Also, when you know what to do, this is actually a very short game. Well, mind you, I don't know if this other path I'm going to be going down is actually going to change much. But I'm curious about that. Because, I don't know, there was a whole section we saw at the end which we didn't even go to. So, I'm wondering what's going to be different. And I'm really curious about that. I've also been kind of looking into other RPG Maker games I could play. Some pretty neat ones out there. Got a candle. Ooh. You know, whatever that says. Yep. <laughs> I wonder, these would probably give you tons of hints if you actually translate them. So I'm, I'm actually curious about that. But uh, who knows? So I never bothered, I know, okay, so thing is I never bothered trying to talk to the girl last time, you notice that? I just instantly pressed the button and she died. I never thought to go and have a friendly conversation. No, why would I do that? Whoop. <laughs> why would I bother doing that? It doesn't make sense, I don't get it. Okay, so we've got that. File five. So, we've got the candle. Fun fact is we can actually use the scissors on these. Yeah, okay. Nice. Tick, tock, and does this kill me? Okay. <laughs> I was so curious. Uh, it's there to it's there really to try and get you to step on it when you go the other way when it's dark. So, I had to check if it was going to work. <laughs> I had to. Okay. Skizzers. Yes. So, this, so far, what we are doing right now is purely under the influence of the fact that we saw a picture saying that... Oh, damn it, I was, too, I was too zealous. I wanted to get in there. But this is all based on the fact that we saw a picture painting, or like burning, the door black with the candle. So that means that to keep the candle, you needed to do certain things differently to have certain items in certain situations. So I thought, what do I use the candle on? I use it on the vines. Is there any other way I can get it so that I still have the scissors by the time I get to the vines? And of course, that meant killing the guy another way. Okay, how can I do that? Well, I know where the button is, and that leaves me the glass shard. So, by process of elimination, you can kind of figure it out. And that's cool. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to go too quick. I've learned what that does to me. Yeah, see that? That's there to try and get you on the time that you come back around. All right, I think I'm good. Good times to use the walk, actually, so that you don't zoom ahead. So yeah, it's, it's actually very cleverly done. It just gives you one hint, but that's enough to make you think about the rest of the playthrough. So I go here. No! But that's not the end. That's not the end, because you could paint it black right now, with the candle, but I actually want to see if I need the lipstick for anything else. Uh, I guess I'll just... I'm making a ton of saves. 
I want to see if I can use the lipstick for anything else. Come back! I just want to have a good time. Give me the painting of the big canvas. Why is there so much blood? But we won't be killing her this time. I'm curious what happens if you just go and talk to her, though. Does she seem like a friendly enough person? Maybe I need the lipstick. There's something in the pot. Hello? Oh! You, you cheeky bitch! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, jeez. I wasn't expecting that, and I think I liked it because of that. <laughs> oh, God. That was amusing. All right, so I want the lipstick, but I want to keep her alive. Because she seems like a cool person, and I can get away with not killing her, which I feel like is a big part of something that we need to do. Because it's a big action. It's like... I don't know what she has to do with anything, but I feel like I feel like we can bond together. Also, I want to feel like I, I want to feel like I want to see if I can do something with that book. That is what I want to see. Can I do something with this book in the red room? All right. Can I paint it? Lipstick. There's nothing nearby to use it on. Sorry, was just pulling up my Beverly's translator. So what's it say? Uh, y, O, I assume you, yeah you, ah, uh, okay yeah ah. Uh, where's the moon? Me, me, you are me. It says. What? I don't know. That's weird. M A. M A K. E make it re, re, no make it a, a make it all red. So something red runs down the mirror. A bottle is full of clear water. Never mind. Wait, can I put the lipstick in there? No. Uh, can I use... Hmm, hmm. I'll clean the dirty brush, right? So the water is now clouded with red. Full of reddish water. The mirror is stained red. There's nothing nearby to use it on. Can I use the brush on it? No. A blank canvas. Oh, maybe I should have... Mm, I don't know. Lipstick? Yeah, make it red, yes. It's red. The canvas is colored red. I don't... Make it all red. Huh. Hmm. I don't know. I do not know. I haven't a clue. Apparently there's a way to bring that book with you, but... I don't know how to do it. So... We're going to... Go and paint the paint the door black with our candle. Oh, actually, hang on. We need to light the candle first. Silly me. I forgot that part. Yes. It's lit, bro. It's lit as fuck in here. All right. And then we'll see what we can do next time. Because I felt like this was going to be a two-parter. But I'll have that one saved for now because I want to make sure that we have a save where we can quickly go and use the red stuff in the red room if that's necessarily a way to do things. So use the lit candle on the door. Yes. The door is burned black. And now things might go differently. This is kind of the same, though. You still are the only one that looks at me? Wow, yeah, we only got here in like 20 minutes. Pretty crazy how short the game is when you know what you're doing. Alright. 
we will be back next time to see if anything else has changed. Because I feel like it's going to happen near the end. So, thank you for watching. Throw us a like if you enjoyed. And I'll catch you next time. Take care. Okay, thanks. Bye. Come on!